Hey guys, what is going on? Today, I get, a, I get an, another Let's Play. I think it's the third one already. And I kind of enjoy the series, so that's why I'm continuing it. And it seems as if most people like it, so that's why I'm continuing it as well. So as you can tell, my base was just attacked. I just got back online after quite a bit, so... I do have some resources to collect and any challenge to look at. And that will be... Oh, uh, that one's easy. Uh, destroy any 35 storages and earn 65 rating. That, that's fairly e easy for the payout it is. And as you can tell, I just earned some diamonds. I won a tournament in first place, so that's 150 diamonds right there. And that put me up above 2,000 again, so that, that that's going to help. And now, um, I'm not too sure what I'm going to do. I could finish this upgrade right here and start something else, but I am not too sure about that. And... I'm going to start a battle, actually. I have mosquitoes and pyros, and I think a couple more things. No, just mosquitoes and pyros. And I'm trying to get I'm trying to get a lot of gold um, so I can start some upgrades. So I'm looking for about 200,000, which might take a while because I know half these bases don't offer that. They just offer, like, the bases that offer a lot of resources kind of are very strong, so I can't really do that. But I'm just looking for something with, there we go, 200,000. It's this is fairly weak. The walls are decent. The towers are decent, but I would say the location of the storages and the oil rigs and mines are crap. All I have to do is destroy these, and then this is all mine. Even though these can do damage, uh, my mosquitoes will take the damage. So, And I didn't mean to spawn that one in. But I'm, I'm going to put my mosquitoes in, so by the time they're done, he can, the mosquitoes can go on to this and basically protect my pyros while they do the damage. And, look look at that, all the resources is gone within, what's that, like 15 seconds of the battle? That That's that's placement right there. If you have bad placement of storages, people will just come just to steal your stuff, and then they'll just end the game. They don't care if they lose or not. Because when you're dropping rating, what I normally do is look for bases that have easiest storages so I can just steal it and then end the game so I drop rating. And it's, it's super efficient, I have to say. Now I'm going to take out this... And I got one star, but I, I doubt we'll get any more. So I want to try to clean up these resources, and hopefully I can take most of them. It looks like I will be able to. I got majority of the gold, which is nice. There's just one more, and that's all we're going to get. So, in the end battle, I think I got like 274,000 and 260,000 oil and gold. That was actually a great win. Um... And it's, it's actually a great payout, too, because that's going to come in handy later on. And it wasn't too hard to get. And I still won, which was awesome. And that's one of my favorite parts about attacking, is you can find the, the, the weakest bases with the worst placement ever. Okay, so now, I'm not too sure what to do. I know I want to start some upgrades, so I'm going to look for 279 diamonds. That's not too much. And then the pyro tower, I wanted to upgrade... Maybe another watchtower, I'm not too sure. That one's 2.5. I was thinking about doing... Um, actually, I completely forgot. I think I was going to do another tower, but I think I'll skip that and go straight for... I'll just upgrade this Jericho, and then I'll start this upgrade. I'm not sure how many diamonds. 487, it's not too bad. And, of course, zero gold, so it's not going to help uh, when I try to attack because I'm not going to be able to skip. And I need 750 gold for another one. And as you can tell, we're not going to get that. because Actually, we got one. So I can change battles once. And that's it. So hopefully I get something easy because I don't have too much. And I only have one worker open now. I spent quite a bit of diamonds, but I'm still looking to send some more. So I'm possibly... Um, I don't. I always want to have one free worker open so I can upgrade anything I want without having to wait. But I'm not too sure what to upgrade. Maybe the maybe the troops. I'm upgrading a Black Hawk to level two. There's really nothing I could upgrade with this amount of gold uh, oil except the invader, which isn't too worth it. So I guess uh, it's 700. That's quite a bit. I guess I'll just finish this. There's another one done. And I guess I'll start, actually I completely forgot once again on what I was about to do. I know it was oil related, so I have two workers open. I guess I'll start upgrading this, might as well, got the oil for it. 
and I got quite a bit of experience points, I gotta say. I almost filled halfway, which is pretty nice. And I don't have too much gold. And I spent about, what's that, 1,200, 1,300 diamonds already? Not too much, but it, it adds up. And I'm not, I'm not really sure what to, what to upgrade now. So, um, I don't want to upgrade the troops because I don't, I don't use Blackhawks at all. So, I guess I will just finish the troops. And of course, using this, this way makes it so much easier. 42 diamonds, 84, it's in a half, which is nicer. I think it's a glitch, but I have no clue. And then more diamonds. And then this one's probably not going to be able to finish because there's too many troops. Now I just have to level it out so it's under 215. And there we go. And that's perfect. Okay, so there we go. Going for another attack. Hopefully I can win, even though I only have 922 gold, and it costs 750, so I can't change it once. I can only attack once. And it looks as oh, that's terrible luck. Um, that, that's just awful luck. 9,000 gold? That's not enough at all. Uh, I'm just going to have to spare the gold. I There's actually a small chance I could get it again. And there we go. I got one more attack. Hopefully I can find something decent with at least 50,000 gold. That would be nice. And something... There we go. Perfect. My luck. Okay, so it looks like all the gold is on this side. Um, there's probably some in here, but that has majority of it, so I'm going to attack that side. 52 pyros this time, so it's going to be fairly simple, but I'll, um, I'll be able to get... Oh, that's that's going to hurt. I'm going to be able to get majority of this gold. If it's all in here, I'll be able to get most of it, actually. I want to try to draw... Uh, lure this champ hero over here so I can take him out and there we go now I'm gonna start spawning some in here and of course they're not going in the direction I want them to um, hopefully they do soon because I want to take this gold there we go I'm going after the gold now and we will we shall see how much gold there is um, it looks like that is majority of it uh, I would say some of it's in the storage still so let's find out not in the store, just the, the mines and stuff. Um, that looks false. No, actually, yep, it's all in the mines, so that's that's good. It doesn't look like the, the oil rigs are filled, but I guess it's just because there's not too much of it. Now, I'll be able to get 50%, there we go. And that's fairly it. I could take out this command center right now, but I'm just going for the gold. And one more here, the last one. And I have four left. Uh, they'll be able to get this, and I want to spawn some bombs in. Oh, they're not going to get to there. Yeah, that's the bad side about this. They can kill that. Um, but it looks like he's about to die anyway. So Pyro Tower is too powerful. And at least he got that. 70%, that's decent. I did I did make up some gold. 192,000 gold, that was, re that was really helpful actually. And that's pretty much it. Um, I think that was like 1,400 diamonds, actually. That's about $10, I would say. Actually, we can check. It's in treasure. All the way in the back, of course. 1,300 is 10 bucks. So it was a little more than 10 bucks, but it was definitely worth it because I, I got most of my troops uh, finished, and I, I did get two attacks off in like 10 minutes, which is great because pyros take about two hours to train, if not more. So as you can tell, two hours, 30 minutes. And that's basically it. And I'll be—I'll have to upgrade. That's what I was should have done. I should have upgraded a barracks because I'm gonna need it because this is 220 uh, troop troop limit. So I'm gonna need to upgrade a barracks soon. So once I get one million oil, I will be able to upgrade it because this is probably too expensive. 463 diamonds, and I would finish it right away because I don't like bat downtime with barracks because it's it's such a delay and it's very annoying actually so and then a level 8 barracks they can train that's the wrong button I think they can train 55 yeah 55 units instead of 50 which that's gonna help a lot so once once the next building is finished and I have 1 million oil I will do that and finish it right away and that would be nice looks like the next building will be done possibly two days yeah that's probably it um, two days, eight hours, and 
yeah, that's that's pretty much it. The six days, it's quite a while, but they turn out really nice. And um, that's basically it for this video. I just wanted to basically spend diamonds and upgrade my base, which obviously worked out pretty well. So thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. And as always, if you have a su suggestion for another video, please post it below. I'll read it as always. And thanks for watching. Have a nice day.